Jackson Lock with you here one more time. GIAA State Championship action. Trinity Crusaders versus for the fourth time this season, Central Fellowship Christian Academy. And there's the star from Central Fellowship, Jalen Goodrum. Can't finish that off early. And that brings me into a key to the game. Trinity has to stay in this game early if they want a shot. In their semifinal game, Central Fellowship got up 18 to nothing before Gatewood even put a point on the board. Trinity has to prevent that if they want any shot at it tonight. Woji tried to lob it in there to Hayden Clay. Hit the rim. What a road it's been to get to this game for the Trinity Crusaders. Of course, 24 and six on the season. Pull up no good. Rebound. Good room with the ball. They'll pull it back out. You got Woji on. I reminded it. Oh, we keep him Woji on three ball. No good. Got to get in there full board. Trinity basketball student section. Fired up blackout over there for the state title game. Trinity 24 and six on the season. Their road to the playoffs, their road to the state championship. They beat Browwood, of course, that was at home, 72-54. Then they got a win against Brentwood at Tackle Square Academy. And then, of course, the thriller against Fertile Prep in the semifinal matchup. Henry Williams looking to strike first. Can't do it, no points on the board. Minute 15 going in the game. State championship. Fourth state championship appearance in program history for the Trinity Crusaders, still looking for that first win. And Hayden Clay draws the first foul of the game. Well, he commits the first foul of the game. Central Fellowship, 27-1 on the season. Their one loss coming to a team out of Florida, North Florida Christian. They are a tough team. They've played Trinity three times, including the region championship. Trinity has lost all three of those games. And as he makes the free throw, make it one to nothing. CFCA strikes blood first. Trinity lost all three of those games, 82-46, their first meeting. As he sinks the other one, 67-49 on their second meeting. And then in the region championship, they lost by 23-76, 53. And that was back on February 17th. Central Fellowship in the midst of a 13-game winning streak. Jim Coleman, no good. Jalen Goodman pushing it quickly. Quickly. Takes it the distance. Blocked by Hayden Clay. Rebound, Devin Nelson. Jim Coleman streaking down the floor when he does so well. He'll lose control. If Henry Williams is going to pull it out, what is that call him right there? Whistle. CFCA ball. Good one with the basketball. Here's your tail of the tape, if you will. CFCA averaging 75 points a game. Trinity Crusaders averaging 65 points a game. And there's Hayden Clay, get out in front. Now Hayden Clay with a chance to fire on this grab. And going down! Striking big in the state championship. Hayden Clay not to back up two to two against Central Fellowship. There you go. Get the adrenaline rolling, get the crowd into it. Listen to that student section, they want to win. Big stuff right there from Hayden Clay. First Hayden Clay jam I've seen of the year. And you couldn't pick a better time. Demery from deep. Knocks it down. As you can hear, I'm on that Central Fellowship side. They're fired up for it. Trinity has the rebound per game advantage as well as assist per game advantage. While well, Central Fellowship has the advantage in points per game. Out of bounds, staying with the Crusaders. Two to two here. No, five to two after the Demery three, excuse me. Crusaders looking to hang with them. Hold away by Jeff Walls. Will George has a good job getting in front. Oh, they get him with a, man. I don't know about it. And it also seemed like a late call. Free throws coming. For Stella. Stella, 71% free throw shooter on the season. He's right there, that student section, right behind the goal. No good on the first. CFCA, their playoff record, obviously 2-0. They had to buy. Then they beat Georgia Christian, 89-51. He'll sink that one. 
And they beat Gatewood 83-55, and they were jumping on Gatewood early. Gatewood only scored three points in the first quarter. I believe it was 25-3 after one. Crusaders got to look to avoid that now. It's 6-2. Clay up top. Good. Good roll from Clay. Cab Woji there for a second. They couldn't see him. Henry Williams going to try to answer. No good. Rebound by the Lancers, and they are pushing. Jalen Goodwin, Goodwin with the bright green shoes on. Andy Frank Woji still guarding him. Got two on him now. Will George, Andy Frank Woji right there. Leave Stella open. Demery in the corner. Great pass from Stella. Knocks it down. Will George averaging 11 points per game with the ball up top. Take it in to pull it. Ah, couldn't get a good look at it. Henry will take it in. Jump stop. Dump it off to Anthony Frank. Woji and the bucket. Great look from Henry. Give him an assist. As he is second on the team in assists, averaging five a game. Give him one right there. Jeb Wall is going to give it over to Goodwin. Oh, my goodness. Great move from Goodwin. Loses the ball. Inbound under the basket, 9-4, to four, 3 minutes, 42 seconds to go in this state championship game in the first quarter. First time since 2009 that we've had a local team in the state championship when the Dublin Fighting Irish beat Blessed Trinity in the state championship game. First time the Crusaders have been in the state championship game since 2000, 23 years in the making here. It's been a historic season already. Got your first playoff win since 2014, the Crusaders did. First 20 win regular season since 1994. And of course, first Final Four and state championship appearance since 2000. Jim Coleman, he sees the lane, he'll take it in, pull up, ew, nearly bounces in. Hayden Clay there for Boyd in the put back. Puts it in there, nine to six, with three minutes to go in the first quarter. Trinity Crusaders are right here in this ball game. Demery gonna take it up, the freshman. He's averaging 11 a game for the Lancers. Walls up top, oh so dangerous. He's short, loose ball. Bounces back out there to Demery. Walls, Jeb Walls with the ball in his hand, committed to Shorter University to play quarterback. Averaging 18 and a half points a game for the Lancers. Ooh, a little behind the back, off his foot. Ooh, I thought, I thought maybe Crusader ball. But you didn't hear a big reaction from the crowd, so it must be a weird angle. What do I know? Inside, Nelson, Hayden Clay. Come on, Hayden. Hayden Clay picks up his second foul. We gotta get him out of there, coach. Two minutes, 21 seconds left to go in the first quarter. <laughs> That's what we can afford. And BCP's checking in. I mean, Hayden's got to sit for a while. You cannot risk it. Nelson, another freshman, gets it in. BCP checks in for Hagen Clay, like I said. Hits them both. Two minutes, 15 seconds to go in the first quarter. Crusaders just down five against this dangerous CFCA team. Going for the weave look up top, handing it off. BCP with it. Back over to BCP. Goodrum got a hand on it. Still Crusader ball, Henry Williams will throw in the inbound pass. Gets it into Will George. BCP picks that up top. Hand off, Will George trying his luck. Knocks it down from behind the college three-point line. Will George, huge shot. Pulls the Crusaders back within two, with under two minutes to go in the first quarter. Big shot from Will George. Goodrum trying to facilitate it in there, falling around backwards. Foul called on, who did they get? Called. I missed it. Henry? 
Must have been Hamer. Head coach John Williams, first year as head coach for the Trinity Crusaders, and a state title game appearance. Goodrum puts it in. In the region championship against the Crusaders, Goodrum had 22 points, three rebounds, and five assists. Can't get that one. Hayden Clay back in the game, gets the board. Now Henry Williams pushing quickly. Ball, still Crusader basketball. Got it knocked out from behind. Minute 24 in the first quarter. Jim Coleman on the inbound, gets it in to Henry. Henry going in for the basket. Makes a great pass over to Jim Coleman. Jim Coleman floats it in there, knocks it down. Three-seeded Trinity Crusaders against the one-seed CFCA. Trinity down one, 12 to 11. Trinity beat the two-seed Fertile Prep. Falcons to get here. Here's Demery with a three. He rolls out, rebound, Hayden. Will George with the ball in hand. Crusaders with a chance to take the lead here with 50 seconds left in the first quarter. Henry takes it in, falling away, knocks it down. Crusaders with the lead, 13 to 12, 35 seconds left to go in this first quarter. Big shot from Henry Williams, averaging 22 a game and a clutch shot here in this first quarter. Devin Nelson here for the Lancers, 25 seconds, takes it in, Hayden be careful. Rebound, Henry Williams, a chance to extend this lead here. Jim Coleman out in front, gets it, oh. And one opportunity nearly, but he'll be going to the line. We got a little scuffle going on down there. Keep it civil. Jalen Goodrum still talking. We got to get, get, give me a technical foul. Crusader fans are livid. Crusader student section giving them everything he can handle. Jalen Goodrum. Talking to the official now, you see it there, bottom left corner. Crowd erupts, Jim Coleman knocks it down. He had some clutch ones in overtime to get us here. Against first top prep, he's looking for another. Back rim, Hank plays there for it. Demery comes away with it. We got 15 seconds now in the first quarter, turning the Crusaders up two. Defense chance going crazy over there for the student section. Under 10 seconds to go in the first quarter, 14 to 12. Jalen Goodrum, he'll probably look for the last shot after all that talk, and he's got to. That's a three. Knock it down. They give it to him. Yes, big shot from Jalen Goodrum. We knew CFCA was ready to play, but these Crusaders are ready to play as well. 14-14 says the scoreboard, but I think it was a three. They're talking it over. I'll have it for you when we come back. As it stands right now, 14-14. Stay with us. State championship on TV 35. Allen's Heating and Cooling is your licensed Amata equipment dealer. Trust Allen's Heating and Cooling to install and service your heating and cooling unit. Allen services all brands and with the purchase of a new Amata, offers a lifetime compressor warranty. Call Sean Clark or any of his friendly staff at Allen's Heating and Cooling. Your Amata dealer. Amata lasts and lasts and lasts. At Dublin Chevy GMC, we have shipments arriving daily. Whether it's Silverados, Yukons, or Tahoes, we have the ride for you. As a matter of fact, I'm doing everything I can to get the trucks ready for you. Whether it's a Blazer or a Terrain or any other crossover, we have the Chevy or GMC for you. And with rates as low as 2.99 on new Silverados, there's never a better time to buy. And remember, Don sells cars well only at Dublin Chevrolet. And we welcome you back, second quarter here of the state championship game. First time TV35 has been able to say that in a very long time as far as basketball is concerned. And here we are today, 14-14 after one knocks it down though. And they're gonna call that good room three, not a three at the end of the quarter, but he just took that the distance. Would have been a huge finish, didn't finish. 14-14, Jalen Goodrum will be at the line. 61% free throw shooter on the season. 
He was named Region Player of the Year along with his teammate Jeb Walls. Now it's down the first one. Student section, give them all they can handle. Puts them both down with a little taunt at the end as well. 16-14, seven and a half minutes to go here in the second quarter. Crusaders got to keep this game within reach. Control the ball. Coleman, look at that off the, oh my goodness, drops a dime in there to Rosie. AFW couldn't pull it in. Great thinking there from Jim Coleman. Jim Coleman checks out BCP in the game. A, uh, BCP in the game, Anthony Frank Woji, Henry Williams, Hayden Clay, Will George, that's the five out there for the Crusaders. Two on them, they switch it off. Three ball, Jalen Goodrum air balls it, and you know the student section gonna let them have it. Henry Williams pushing now, down two, seven minutes to go in the second quarter. Pull up from the forward logo, no, won't go, AFW. Over the back. Got to be careful. Got to be careful. Goodrum pass in to Nelson. Nelson gives it back to Goodrum. Jalen Goodrum averaging 20.1 points a game all season long for the Lancers. Uh, yeah, the Lancers. Excuse me. Nelson, that's a three. No good, nearly wedged it in there. Fouls are killing them. Fouls are killing me. Will George's second foul. I mean, we can't, we can't afford fouls here under any circumstance. The bench is not deep. You've got a six, you've got your starters and then one man rotation. Jim Coleman's back in for AFW. I mean, you gotta play with some caution here. 17-14. Six and a half left to go in the second quarter. Gets them both, puts the lead back to four. Will George looking to take control. Jim gives it over to Henry. Henry coming off that huge game in the semifinals. 27 points, eight rebounds, five assists. Gives it over to Hayden, had a huge game as well, 18 points. Foul call against the Lancers. And now coming from under the basket. Stack it up. Gotta find somebody. Ah, yeah, had nothing. Good run, running. There we go, Jim Coleman with the steal. Henry Williams out in front now. CFCA recovers well. They're back there. Henry's going to pull up in the paint short. Rebound, Jeb Walls. He's pushing it now. Walls averages 18 and a half a game. Pull up. Knocks it down. Big shot, big shot. Lead back to six. Very smart timeout by Coach Williams. 20 to 14, 550 left to go in the second quarter. Smart timeout. Get your boys some water. Talk it over. We'll be back. State championship right here on TV35. Hi, I'm Chase Wilson. I am the 2023 president of the Order of the Shillelagh, and uh, I'm happy to welcome you all into our community for the St. Patrick's Day Festival. One of my personal favorite events is the Balloon Fest which is a really unique event to middle Georgia. Uh, we've got balloons coming in from all over the country and the folks who are putting that on have done a great job. Uh, especially like to thank St. Gobain for sponsoring that event. And uh, I know it's, it's something that my family and I are, are all looking forward to. That's March 10th and 11th. It's going to be at the Civitan Fairgrounds, which is a departure. It has historically been at Southern Pines, but um, to, to, because of some of the expansions, we're having it at uh, the Civitan Fairground this year. So that's March 10th and 11th. 
Uh, you can find out details about that event, memberships, all, all sort of things St. Patrick's related uh, at the website on the screen. Come out and join us at the 58th annual St. Patrick's Day Festival. Aaron, go bra. Welcome to the back to the state championship right here on TV 35. Our Trinity Crusaders are down six to the Central Fellowship Christian Academy Lancers. We've got five and a half minutes left to go in this first half. Crusaders coming out of the timeout, slowing things down. We've got 15 seconds now on the shot clock. Will picks up his dribble. Henry comes over and helps him out. Scream set by Jim Coleman. Henry trapped in the corner. Ah, Demery got a hand on it. BCP might have to pull it. He'll take it in. Shot clock expires against the Crusaders. Goodrum passes it in. The Demery, Demery gives it back to Goodrum. Demery and Goodrum, what a tandem. Demery had 20 points in that region title game against the Crusaders. Goodrum thinks about a deep three. Demery might pull that, he won't take it in. He walked. And he did walk. Four forty-five in the first half. Inside Hayden did some great work in the semis. Can't finish that one off. Jim Walls coming the other way. Thanks about pulling up BCP. Good defense. Devin Nelson, the freshman, gives it over to Demery in the corner. No good. Will George now out in front running. Two on one. He'll just pull up. That's the spot for Will George. Short arms it, rebound, Hayden Clay puts it in. See, Will George is a rare breed. He knew he short on that thing, and then he immediately following his shot, rebound, we'll get in there to Hayden Clay. I mean, great stuff right there from Will George. You don't see it all the time. You don't see everybody else making those hustle plays, but you see them from Will George. BCP, Jim Coleman now out running. He might take it as distance. He'll try it off the left hand. Can't finish, pulled away by Will George. Jim Coleman, another chance, gets fouled. Lancer fans letting their voices be heard. Jim Coleman at the line. Jim shooting a 51% on the year. But we got a timeout before that, ladies and gentlemen. Stay with us right here. State championship from Hawkins Arena at Mercer University. Trinity Crusaders just down four with three minutes, 43 seconds left to go in the first half. You're watching TV 35. I'm Heath Richter, and uh, we just uh, want to invite everybody to come on down to uh, the Houston Clinic and check us out at our new facility. Uh, we've been in Dublin for a while now, obviously, but uh, have, uh, have a new office here, and we'd just like you to come down and see some of the new stuff we're offering. And uh, if you need to get checked out, we'd be glad to do that for you. We've got to uh, able to do some ultrasound guided injections now and um, physical therapy and just a little bit better space, so hopefully we can get you in and out of here a little bit quicker. Come by and see us today at our brand new location, the Houston Clinic Medical Drive in Dublin. All right, welcome back. Jim Coleman at the line, down four. Knocks it down. Twenty to seventeen. Ice cold puts them both in there. Jeb Walls with the rock. Jalen Goodrum knocks it down. Huge shot from Goodrum. He's feeling it. Puts him back up five with 3.20 left to go. Inside, Hayden Clay. Good pass from Jim Coleman. Can't finish it off. Hayden Clay picks up his third foul of the game. He's got three fouls now. We still have three minutes, 13 seconds left to go in the second quarter. And I can't stress enough, like, 
That's, that hurts bad. Trinity Student Station, a little back and forth with CFCA. They say scoreboard. It's kind of early for me. Kind of early to be saying scoreboard. Henry Williams put a little move on him. Goodrum v. Williams, what a combo. Coleman, hard, back rim. Nelson pushes it up floor to Jalen Goodrum. Goodrum thinks about another deep three. They'll move it back around. Walls over to the corner. Great ball movement here from the Lancers. Stella with the basketball. They've got 14 seconds on the shot clock, using all of it as they can. Nelson, hold away, saves it. Goodrum, three ball, no good. AFW, rebound. With 2.14 to go in this first half. Henry, he'll take it himself with some touch. Puts it in there. Lead is three once again. Oh, Will George try to jump it. Three ball from the corner. Big shot from the Lancers. Knocks it down, minute 40 to go. Six point lead now for Central Fellowship. As the Crusaders are looking for their first ever state championship win. Will George sets a pick on Goodrum. Gives room for a Henry pump fake. If he hits that, that crowd's going crazy. Henry Williams knocks it down. Pump fake, Goodrum bid on it. Henry knocks it down, puts the Crusaders back down three. 26-23. Cross court pass to Goodrum. CFCA playing smart ball, using all that clock. Gets it to his man, Nelson. Movement everywhere. He'll try another corner three, whistle. The fouls are killing me. And Hayden Clay's checking back into the game. Oh my goodness. So foul on Jim. Hayden Clay's ready to check back in over there. Hayden Clay has three fouls. With, and we're still in the first half. And that is scary. They're saying he's got two shots or three shots. I'm not sure. First one's good. Second one, no good, he'll have three. <laughs> Hayden Clay back into the game, Jim Coleman checks out. Three fouls on Hayden here. Cannot afford that fourth. Gets the shooter's bounce, puts him back up five. We've got 49 seconds to go in this half. Defense chance going crazy. Will George is going to try a three. He's short. From behind the college line, he was short. Please be careful. Can't afford foul trouble. He hit one earlier. He hits one again. He's coming up huge for the Lancers. 15 seconds. Crusaders need something. I'm taking the last shot. 10 seconds. Will George gonna take it in. Wild layup attempt, no good. Five seconds, they got a shot at something. Good room. At the end of the first half, air ball. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, stay with us. Crusaders battling. It's the state championship right here on TV 35. Second half coming up to this. 31-23. My name is Jeremy Blackstock. I'm the head of school at Trinity Christian. We would invite you to come to our campus so we can show you around and discuss ways that we can partner with your family in Christian education. Our goal here is to teach the truth and to have students leave here prepared to serve others and serve God in their communities.
Hi, I'm Kyle Gerard with A-Plus Flooring and Construction. If you're in the market for a complete home remodel, come see us. If you just want floors, maybe a new construction build, cabinets refurbished, or even a whole bathroom remodel, come see us at A-Plus Flooring and Construction, 371 Georgia Highway 338, or give us a call, 478-676-2662. Look forward to doing business with you. Here we go, second half, state championship on the line. After one quarter of play, it was 14 to 14. The Crusaders had it knotted up. After two, they find themselves down 31-23, and that's really all on the back of not Jeb Walls, but his little brother Knox Walls. Not down two threes and two free throws near, near the end of that first half. Other than that, Crusaders hanging tough, a lot of clutch shots, clutch threes, and clutch shots all around the basket in the first half for the Crusaders. That won't fall from Anthony Frank Woji. Oh, a little pushy. Jeb Walls. No good. Got to get, got to have it. Got to have it. Good one. Sees Demery straight up, straight up, straight up. Good. Puts it in. From inside the paint. 10 point, uh, yeah, 10 point lead now from Mercer University. Henry trying to make it a seven point lead, no good. Those are some deep threes. Here's Demery, Hayden Clay, please. Oh. I had the... I had the, the reaction there, Hayden's fourth foul. And we are only a minute and 12 seconds into the third quarter. And Hayden Clay has four fouls. Does not bode well the rest of the way. Cannot pick one up, and he's still in the game. Rolling the dice, 36-23. Crusaders back down 13 now. Biggest lead of the game for the Lancers. They've come out hot out of their locker room. Henry Williams, the leading scorer in the first half of the Crusaders with seven points. Jim, no good. There's Anthony Frank with it. Got to dominate down there. Good. AFW draws the contact, and he'll be shooting two. Two free throws coming for Anthony Frank. Need them big here. AFW had a big game in that semifinals. Eight points, 20 rebounds. That'll knock down his first lead down to 12. AFW averaging 11 rebounds this season. Gets them both. Good stuff. 11 point lead. 6.15 to go. Jim Coleman on Jeb Walls. Will George jumps out on him. He's open for a deep two. No good. Long rebound. Jim Coleman's there for it. Now Will George pushing it down the other end. Oh, great pass to Jim Coleman. Drops a dime. Around Jeb Walls. A dime from Will George. Who averages six assists a game. And a lot of them are passes like that. The kid's insane. Here's Goodrum, please, no. He gets it. Hayden Clay doesn't draw the foul with five and a half to go. Jim Coleman travels. CFC ball up 11 with five and a half to go in the third quarter. Nelson loses his balance. I, did, I mean, that's a wall. Jim Coleman foul, picked up against Jim Coleman. No, they're saying Will George. Will George's third foul. Oh, this is not good. GIAA AA state championship on the line. Lancers go back up. 39-27 at another 
tally. They're up 12. Rebound for Henry. He'll pull up, deep three, no good. Rebound falls in the hands of Demery. He'll take it himself. Pull it back, he's gotta get across half court. He does, loses it. Demery, all kind of, all kind of juking. Henry doesn't bite on it and he walks. Full setter ball, under five minutes to go. Got to have something here. Got to have a spark. Got to have a run. You need it. You need it big. This third quarter is huge. You got to go into the fourth quarter with an, at least a tight game for the Crusaders. Henry, we're going to take it in. Jump, stop, shot. Good. Back within 10. Three sports star, Jalen Goodrum. Soccer, football, basketball star for the Lancers. Will trying to jump it. Oh, spin move. Foul called. Is that gonna be against Hayden? Foul on Jim, who has four. Will George has three. Jim Coleman has four. Hayden Clay has four. That's a big disadvantage. Trying to go on a run, come back, get in this game, and half your team is nearly fouled out. You've got two at four and one at three. That one won't go. I mean, where's the, where's the urgency for a board? All right, we got it, though. 40 to 29, four minutes. Good run, V. Williams. <laughs> Offensive foul, five seconds. Three seconds in the lane. I don't know. CFC are running. And they hit. Foul on Henry. Henry giving him the shoulder from behind, and we got an injury. Demery, he's up. Few CFCA fans about to lose their minds over here. Call him for Henry Williams' head. Are some of these Lancer fans? Not a shooting foul. And timeout call by the Crusaders. Smart timeout down 11, midway through this third quarter. Stay with the state championship action right here on TV 35. Automax, your local repair shop, family owned and operated. Our mechanics are all ASC certified for 100% satisfaction guaranteed. We service all makes and models, foreign and domestic. So come see us at Automax for complete auto repair. We offer certified auto repairs, mufflers, brakes, engine repairs, diagnostics, struts, suspension, and a whole lot more. That's Automax, 707 Kellum Road, Dublin. Call us at 606-6868. We're open Monday through Friday, 8 to 5. Automax. You've dreamed about the perfect house, a place to call your own, and a place to not only stretch out, but to grow. Auto Owners protects your house because to you, it's home. That's simple human sense. Ask Curry Maffet Insurance in Dublin if Auto Owners make sense for you. Happy to help, man. I was just over there talking to myself anyway. Here we go, we're back in play. Tension through the roof in Hawkins Arena tonight. You play a team four times, bound to happen. Short. Fight for the ball, Devin Nelson comes away with it. Jeb Walls coming in. 3.45 to go now in the third quarter. During that break, we had a pretty well extended timeout. Both these teams, chance to catch the breath. Crusaders 
Use it as a long timeout. That's not a foul. That's not a foul. Foul called against Anthony Frank Logie. I mean, that's his third. All right, from memory here, I know Will has three, Jim Coleman has four, Aiden Clay has four, Anthony Frank Logie has three. Jalen Gerber misses his first. Only a 61% free throw shooter on the year. Rebound, Anthony Frank Wojcik. Crowds are definitely about to go back and forth. Be prepared. Henry Williams. Long bouncer over to Will. Only down 11 right here. Need a run going into the fourth quarter with three minutes, 20 seconds to go left in this third. On the forward logo, gives it over to Henry. Henry gonna take it in. Oh my goodness, what a move. Midi, no good. Rebound, there you go, Hayden. Use that length. Will George take it out, get it in to Hayden. BCP from three, misses. Rebound, Henry Williams right there, four puts it in. Single digit lead now for the Lancers, 40-31. Trinity Crusaders right here in the thick of it with two minutes and 50 seconds left to go in the third quarter. Devin Nelson takes it in, good spin move. Pretty clean, can't lie to you. Not much you can do about that uh, either. Will George, you got to pull that. They'll take it in. Foul against Goodwin. Foul against Jalen Goodrum. Number five of the Lancers. 42-31. Woji, hand off the wheel, finishes, can't. Took it to the bucket, just a little too much heat on it. 2.29 to go here. We'll stack it up. AFW put it in the corner. Good setup. Set the pick for Henry. Take it in. Left hander. It's good. Long pass to Goodwin. We'll get out in front. You got to step in front. And that is a foul against BCP. They're killing. They get out in front like that. Crusaders aren't ready for it and just too fast. And then BCP picked the foul up. The lead is nine, 42-33. Goodrum back in the line. No good. Jalen Goodrum averaging 20 points a game, 5.6 rebounds a game, and also leads the Lancers with 3.6 assists a game. <laughs> Misses his first, gets his second, lead back to 10. Crusaders trying to come away with something. We have two minutes left in this quarter. Henry, kick it back over to Will. Ah, dangerous handoff. Goodrum, good defense. Henry will take it in. Foul called against Jalen Goodrum. Technical foul issued against Jalen Goodrum, who's headed to the bench area and takes a seat. Puts his jersey over his face. Timeout is called. It is pandemonium in Hawkins Arena. Crusader fans on their feet. 2-0-1 and a timeout call. Ladies and gentlemen, it's getting wild up in here. And we got a full quarter after this two minutes in the third. Stay with the state title on the line right here from Hawkins Arena at Mercer University. North, South, East, or West, Friendly Gus is on your way today. Fuel up with Friendly Gus's delicious breakfast, made fresh every day. Your wallet and your belly will thank you. 
Choose from our 20, 40, and 60 piece chicken finger and wing platters. And don't forget the tater logs. Our food is always fresh and our service is always friendly. Friendly Gus, on your way today. Also shop Cochran Brothers Cash and Carry at 320 South Jefferson in Dublin for additional items like paper products, chicken wings, bulk drinks, spices, sauces, and more. Looking for your pot of gold? Look no farther than Century 21 Durden Cordega Realty. When it comes to buying or selling your home, Century 21 is the number one realty company in Dublin and Lawrence County. Count on Brian Howell, Charlene Lamp, Adam White, David Deves, Jennifer Bradley, Mark Bateman, Jay Brantley, Jim Jarrett, Raina Dubberly, Yvonne Robertson, our broker George Durden and you'll find your pot of gold. Century 21 Durden Cornegay Realty. Log on to c21dublin.com. Stop by 1700 Veterans Boulevard or call us at 478-272-1535. Century 21 Durden Cornegay. Broker George Durden. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. And there's Jalen Goodrum. I don't know his status. He may be out for the ball game. It looks like it. Technical foul was issued on it. And Henry Williams at the line, and 43-33, a huge chance right here to get back into this game. And if Jalen Goodrum is done, anything can happen right here. Crusaders down nine with two minutes left in this third quarter. Let's do it. Let's do it. State title on the line. Henry Williams, as clutch as they come, pulls them back within eight. Woo, two minutes is a lot of time. And that is just in the third quarter. It's 43-35. Here we go. Got to move quickly still. Got to have that sense of urgency. Henry. Good room not on him anymore. Will George. That's deep three. No good. AFW in there. Offensive rebound. Picks up the foul. And he'll talk a little something. He's fired up. AFW has got two shots on the way. Minute 48, he went two for two on his previous trip. Ice cold with AFW against the first. Back within seven, that's where we started the quarter at. Down seven. AFW ice cold, four for four from the free throw line and we're back within six with a whole minute 45 left to go in the third quarter of the GIAA State Championship right here on TV 35. Both crowds getting into it. Defensive chance coming from the Crusaders side. Demery takes it in. Back out. Devin Nelson, three ball. No good. Ayers. Minute 30. 43-37. Crusader fans coming alive. Crusader boys trying to go on a run. Henry Williams taking it in. Float it. He goes! Down four with a minute 15 left in the third quarter of the state title game. Trinity Crusaders looking to win the state championship from Hawkins Arena. Minute 05, within four, Jalen Gildrum on the bench. Walls pull up, always foul. My BCP, good sportsmanship. Love sit. 57 seconds for this Trinity Crusader team left in the third quarter, and of course for the Lancers as well. Crusaders, historic season, looking to put a bow on this thing today, and they've already, just by coming out here, playing with these boys. <laughs> Student section making all the noise they can. Jeb Walls can't hit on his first. Jim Coleman ready to check back in. Get this first one, and they're calling it a three, so I have another. Jim Coleman, his foul count, three or four, I think four. Of course, keep in mind all the foul trouble the Crusaders are in. Forty-four, thirty-nine. Six point lead for the Lancers. 55 seconds, clock rolling in the third quarter. Here comes Henry. 
Double picks up top. Ah, ball knocked away. Hayden ah, couldn't put a grab on it. Lancer ball with 48 seconds. They're on six. Jeb Walls will be their main ball handler. Demery with it up top. Henry on him. Demery, pull up. No good. Rebound to AMW. We got shot clock turned off. 25 seconds to go. Crusaders with the rock in their hands. Let's see what kind of strategy they go with here. Do they want to use all the clock? It looks like they do. 15 seconds. Henry hands it to Jim. AFW ready to set a pick up top. 10 seconds. Seven seconds. Handoff up top. We're looking for a three here, maybe to close it out. It is a Will George three, short. Henry on the putback, no good. Henry Williams, no good on the putback. We're right here in it, folks. Fourth quarter of the GIAA State Championship is on the way. The Trinity Crusaders are down six. Stay with us for history on the line. You're watching TV 35. Georgia Military College is a two-year associate's degree granting institution. We are an open admissions college. What that means is all you need to do is have a high school diploma or a GED to get accepted into GMC. We offer several associate's degree programs including business administration, pre-nursing, psychology, criminal justice, as well as education. We offer classes during the morning, evening, and at night. We even offer some weekend classes. We offer online classes as well as in-seat classes, whatever is convenient for you and your schedule. We are located at 200 South Jefferson Street in Dublin, Georgia. If you want a great education with small class sizes, affordable tuition, we would love to see you here. Stop by to see us or give us a call. Start here, go anywhere. Georgia Military College, Dublin Campus. Fourth quarter, GIAA State Championship from Mercer University. Trinity Crusaders in their first state title game in 23 years. First year head coach John Williams has led the boys all year, and they are looking to close it out with a state championship. They're down six. Jalen Goodrum done for the day. Not in the ball game, he's done. Thrown out, 7.40 to go. Nelson tries a little spin move. Crusaders sitting in their defense. Nothing easy. Jim Coleman, good move from Nelson. That's a beautiful, beautiful move. Wish I had skills like that. I mean, that's beautiful. Will George got it on the logo up top, 47-39. Weaving up top, big, two bigs are down low. AFW and they can play. Henry, step back. Thinks about it. He will try that one. No, he won't. He'll give it to Hayden. He'll put it up and no good. Gets his own board, puts it up and in. Should have been an and one. He's got to get up and get down the floor. Got to move quick. He's straight up, straight up, straight up, straight up, straight up, straight up. Oh, Devin Nelson, no. No fouls called. Devin Nelson, no good. He's down on the floor. Crusaders now. Here's Jim Corbin. Pulls it back out. Devin Nelson, he's up down there. Here comes Will George Floater. Puts it in. 47-43 with six and a half to go. State championship. Your Crusaders are down just four. I mean, it's everything you dreamt of here, folks. you got to stay with us through the end of it. Time for the ball. Demery pulls it away. Nelson. Coming in, puts it up, no good. Rebound on the back side, Stella. Three ball, no good. Rebound, Will George. And foul against Demery. Foul caught against Demery. Six minutes to go in the ball game. This is it. State championship. Trinity Crusaders are down four. After this, and this CFCA team has beaten them by 18 plus three times this year. Henry Williams pull up short arms. He's saying it was tip. Saying it should be Crusader ball. Crusader fans are agreeing with Henry. I didn't see. I'm not saying there wasn't. I'm just saying I didn't see. We got 545 to go. 
Devin Nelson coming back in, loses it. Crusader basketball, 5.37 and a timeout call by CFCA. And the down four, and the Crusader fans in that student section are having the time of their lives. The Crusaders are down four with five and a half minutes to go in the GIAA State Championship. Stay with us on TV 35. Allen's Heating and Cooling is your licensed Amana equipment dealer. Trust Allen's Heating and Cooling to install and service your heating and cooling unit. Allen services all brands and with the purchase of a new Amana, offers a lifetime compressor warranty. Call Sean Clark or any of his friendly staff at Allen's Heating and Cooling. Your Amana dealer. Amana lasts and lasts and lasts. Since 1965, our family has proudly provided physical, occupational, and speech therapy to Dublin, Lawrence County, and surrounding areas. Currently offering physical and occupational therapies, our mission is to work with patients and their families to reach an optimum level of independence. Whether post-sports injury, post-surgery, post-stroke, or just general wear and tear from everyday living, we strive to help you reach your goals and return to what you love doing. Remember, where you go for physical and occupational therapy is your choice. So, when your doctor prescribes it, choose Bass. We welcome you back to Hawkins Arena where it looks like half of Dublin has filled that side of the floor. And they are here rooting their boys on. They're down four in the state championship. State title, I mean, it's so prestigious. I mean, obviously, first time being here in 23 years. Henry Williams, no good. Lancer ball, 513 in the fourth quarter. It's 47 43. Jeb Walls, the senior, with the ball. Tipped away, lost. Foul called against Devin Nelson of the Lancers. Will George will pass it in. Under five to go here, down four. State championship. Henry Floater puts it in. Pretty, pretty, pretty Henry Williams. But look, the Crusaders are down two, ladies and gentlemen. Nelson, that's got to be Crusader ball. It is. Henry down on the floor. That is not a good. He's got to. He's got to get off. He's got to get off. He's staying on. You got to get him off the floor. I, I mean, grabbing at the the face. You know what I mean? I don't know what happened. I, I'm. I'm just scared for a concussion's sake. But if he, I mean, if he's poking in the nose or the eye, that's one thing. Grabbing at the head like that. Scary sight. We'll see. Here he comes. Going to take it in, pull it out, slips. Will with the ball. 423 for the tie. No good. Demery screaming down the court. Jim Coleman. Oh, come on, he walked. Rebound AFW. Didn't finish it off. Oh, he got it pulled away from behind. Jim Coleman secures it. Henry Williams comes away with it. Three on three. Henry Williams going to take it in. Foul call. Four oh three. In the fourth quarter to go. Crusaders from under the basket. Down two. Henry Williams still in the game. Will George gonna try the three for the lead? Oh my goodness. No good. Oh, the Crusaders. Look at you. Sticking all the way through the end of this thing, man. Boys came to play. The freshman, Demery, handling the ball now. No Jalen Goodwin. That, uh, kicked out. Jeb Walls, pump fake, 
Couple more pump fakes. Devin Nelson, he'll try the deep three. No good. Rebound, that's a foul. Will George gets sandwiched going for that rebound. I can't take it. I can't take it, ladies and gentlemen. My stomach is churning. And off dangerous one. Henry, you gotta pull that. You gotta pull that. Henry for the lead. Knocks it down! The Trinity Crusaders have the lead! 48-47! The Trinity Crusaders on top in the fourth quarter of the state championship. Jeff Wall's the answer. No good! Rebound, Henry. He's coming with it. Gotta watch his back, pulls it out. Oh my goodness. State title, ladies and gentlemen. 2.50 to go. The Trinity Crusaders with the lead. Henry's going to take it in. Flow there, layup. No good. Foul charge. <laughs> Offensive foul against Henry Williams. <laughs> Trinity getting set up. Set up back there. And you're set up for a TV 35 instant classic. State championship. Come on. Nelson with the ball, Hayden Clay, tightly guarding him. AFW's gonna step out there, he's pulling it out. Jeb Walls with the basketball now, they're down one. 48-47, Trinity Crusaders on top against the powerhouse Central Fellowship Christian Academy. Lancers who have one loss on the season. And that's for a team from Florida, for the lead, short. Rebound, Will George. Trying to contain my emotions over here. 2-15, 48-47. Crusaders on top. Weaving it, weaving it, weaving it. We've seen it a lot of times. You can't really run out the clock with just a one point lead. Five seconds. Will George, gotta get something, gotta get something. Here's Henry, deep three. Knock it down! Henry Williams with the Crusaders up four. It's pandemonium in here. 51-47. He throws it out of bounds. Don't. Trinity Crusaders. A minute and 40 to go. Timeout. It's called. Oh, my goodness. Stay with us for the historic finish. A TV 35 instant classic. Trinity Crusaders up four, looking to secure a state championship. Stay with us. It'll be their first in program history if they can pull it off. You're watching the game of the year on TV 35. At Dublin Chevy GMC, we have shipments arriving daily. Whether it's Silverados, Yukons, or Tahoes, we have the ride for you. As a matter of fact, I'm doing everything I can to get the trucks ready for you. Whether it's a Blazer or a Terrain or any other crossover, we have the Chevy or GMC for you. And with rates as low as 2.99 on new Silverados, there's never a better time to buy. And remember, Don sells cars well only at Dublin Chevrolet. My name is Jeremy Blackstock. I'm the head of school at Trinity Christian. We would invite you to come to our campus so we can show you around and discuss ways that we can partner with your family in Christian education. Our goal here is to teach the truth and to have students leave here prepared to serve others and serve God in their communities. I've got chills. Not a Crusader fan sitting down. A minute 30. The Trinity Crusaders are up four points. In the state championship, they're going to say two, Crusader basketball, 23 seconds on the shot clock. Your Trinity Crusaders are up in the state title game by four to a CFCA team who is 27-1, who has beat the Crusaders this year by 36, by 18, and by 23. Lancer ball. We've got a minute 25, Devin Nelson dangerous with the ball, gives over to the other freshman. And now he'll hand it. Jeff Wall is over, Nelson, huge three. Short! With a 
one minute oh five to go. Can you believe it? Do you believe in miracles? Here comes Henry Williams. Hand off to Will George. Oh my goodness, under a minute to go. 50 seconds, 50 seconds. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. I'm only thinking Kevin Garnett here. Anything is possible. Henry Williams pulls it back out. Hayden Clay to put him on six. Hayden Clay puts it in. Trinity Crusaders on six points. 53-47 all the way. AFW with a block. CFCA basketball under the rim. 32 seconds to go. Will George calls the timeout. Don't pop your confetti just yet. 53-47. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm staying with you. No way I'm taking a break right here. History on the line. This Trinity team, the first in nine years to win a playoff game. 23 years since a Final Four appearance, they do that. 23 years since a state title appearance, they do that. With 32 seconds away from the first state championship in program history. History on the line right now. And who else to do it but the starting five, Hayden Clay, Will George, Jim Coleman, Anthony Frank Wojcik, and Henry Williams. Live from Hawkins Arena, it's the state championship. The Trinity Crusaders looking to pull it off. Tries the three. Short! Hayden Clay is fouled. How far are we from the bonus? Not in the bonus yet. I have no idea. It says CFC has five team fouls, so maybe one. They got a foul. They got a foul. We've got 24 seconds. They foul. They foul. Put it down, AFW. And it could be a technical. They have a case. They don't, they don't tee up AFW. For a fact, I know GHSA, that probably would have been a technical. GIAA, thankfully, they're letting it slide here. We're in the bonus. Man, if, if we can get a regulation don't right here. You're witnessing history. Student section, rolling bananas. I'm about to lose my mind. Trinity Crusaders about to pull off the impossible. Right here. Nobody picked them. It was as improbable as it gets. The team of destiny, the Trinity Crusaders, are up 54-47. Make it 55. Ladies and gentlemen, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. We're about to see it. Oh, that's a block. Foul called. 18 seconds. But they get ready. Oh my goodness. It's about to happen. 17.8 seconds away from the Trinity Crusader State Championship. Inbound from behind the basket. They gotta move quickly. Look at Will! Loose ball, 10 seconds. Oh, come on. 11.1 second. Eight point lead. Oh my goodness. Another timeout called. This place is about to come unglued. I'm about to come unglued. 11.1 seconds from the first state title in program history in John Williams' first year as head coach. The Trinity Crusaders about to silence everybody and win a state championship. The crowd has come out today. Look at that student section. TCS chants everywhere. Crusader fans about to storm the court. We got 11.1 to go right here. It's the state tournament, state championship. Crusader basketball. This will be the first championship in program history. The first in count, the first since Dublin won one in 2009 for the county. Devin Nelson side inbound. 
11.1 to go. And ladies and gentlemen, thank you for letting me be on this ride all season long. Called the Crusaders all year. Here I am. I feel like I'm part of the team. Jail Ball is fouled. He'll have three shots. We got 8.1. I mean, it's going to take a lot for, for CFC at eight seconds and three shots here. They, those, these will be big. Three shots, but then they'll have to foul, and it's going to take three throws after that. It does not seem likely if Jeb Walls can't hit these. Fifty-five, forty-eight. He'll hit that one, ladies and gentlemen. We've got another timeout call by Coach John Williams. Final timeout for the Crusaders. We're going to stay with you, ladies and gentlemen. Eight seconds to go. Coach John Williams' strategy. Protect the basketball at all costs. Get it in, they're gonna foul you. I, if I'm getting it, I'm getting it, I'm planting my feet, and I'm holding it. We got eight seconds, you can't get a backcourt call. Hold it for as long as you can, and let them foul you, and we'll knock down the free throws. Moments away from the Trinity Crusaders pulling off the state championship victory. The student body is here. A large chunk of Dublin, Georgia in the house. Horn blows, we're ready to go. 8.1. And we've got a, a horn blows. Looks like an accidental horn. Give the Crusaders an extra second. Turn the Crusaders eight seconds away. And they foul Henry immediately. One second off the clock. Man, you're going to put Henry at the line? You're going to put Henry Williams at the line? Henry will have, let's see, is it one and one or two? Should be two shots. Right there, looking at the student section. Shots coming for Henry Williams. One and one, no good. Hang Clay, pull back, gets it, and one. Put a little icing on the cake. Hayden Clay puts it in there. Crusaders not in there. Setting up on defense back here. Boys are ready. Pulling off the impossible. Hayden Clay, short. This will be it. Trinity Crusaders are state champions. They take down Central Fellowship Christian Academy, the first state title in school history. Ladies and gentlemen, they pull off the impossible tonight. The Trinity Crusaders are the 2023 GIAA state champions. What a storybook season it has been for the Trinity Crusaders. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for letting me along the ride. This is a state championship for the Trinity Crusaders. And you saw it all right here on TV 35, state champion Trinity Crusaders. 
they'll celebrate with the students. I'm signing out, state champion, Trinity Crusaders. Thank you for tuning in tonight, ladies and gentlemen.